farmers are rallying behind President Trump and his efforts to make fair trade deals in the U.S. One America's Karen McKinney has more on his trip to Louisiana. On every front, we are fighting for our great farmers our ranchers, our growers. President Trump draws thunderous applause from farmers at the 100th annual farm convention in New Orleans. Taken to the stage Monday, the president urged farmers not to get discouraged as his administration continues to, quote, fix horrible trade deals around the globe. The ball is now in Congress's court to approve the replacement NAFTA deal President Trump struck with Mexico and Canada last year. The USMCA is expected to boost manufacturing jobs in the U.S. and help dairy farmers break into the Canadian market. But we do support him in his trade negotiations. We really support him with the trade negotiations with New Mexico, or Mexico and Canada because... Like I say, those, those deals were not fair, and, and he's done a lot to help us. He's done a, a tremendous lot with, with, the, with the trade. Farmers at the convention also applauded the president's efforts to roll back burdensome EPA regulations, making it easier for Americans to farm and ranch on their own lands. President Trump also touched on the state of trade negotiations with China as the clock continues to run on a 90-day truce on tariffs. The White House has been firm in demanding China make concessions on trade, including giving American providers fair market access and cracking down on intellectual property theft. Despite tense negotiations affecting certain markets like soybeans, the president said farmers know better than anyone else that these tough choices will pay off in the end. And although trade has hurt us personally a little bit because we were exporting to China, because of the trade, we was able to move our product, but it, the price was down a little bit for a little while because of the trade, but but because of other uh, market factors, it didn't hurt us that much, and so we we were okay okay with it. To help effective farmers during trade negotiations with China, the White House has created a $12 billion fund to provide relief. And perhaps most importantly, the president focused much of his attention on the issue of illegal immigration and the importance of building a wall. To prove his point, the president brought a farmer on stage who was shot last year by suspected drug traffickers after crossing the border illegally. Mr. President, we need a wall. President Trump promised to stay the course on delivering on his promise to secure the border and said he's willing to work with farmers on immigration reform to make it easier for them to find workers. To all of the farmers here today and across our country, the greatest harvest is yet to come. The future for America's farmers is bigger, better, bolder, and brighter than ever before. Kara McKinney, One American News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.